Hi. If this year has taught us anything, it's that we can come together in more imaginative ways than ever before. This was the inspiration behind a new collaboration between Astral Arts, Play On Philly, and Mural Arts Philadelphia. Yay! Great collaboration. In this series of virtual concerts, Astral and Play On Philly have joined together to create short performances by musicians of all ages and levels of experience. Each concert pairs works from the Mural Arts Collection with a specific instrument group, brass, percussion, woodwinds, harp, and strings. Welcome to a journey of expression and creativity through murals and music. Welcome to Young at Art. Thank you. Hi, my name is Akaya McClinney, and I have been playing the clarinet for seven years with Play on Philly. As part of the Young at Art project, we explored how a piece of visual art influenced the way we play music on our instruments. The pop wind ensemble chose the murals Staircases and Mountaintops, Ascending Beyond the Dream. This collection of murals symbolizes activists' arduous journey to attain their full rights. We love how this mural highlights civil rights era leaders and uses colors and shapes to express dreams, goals, and progress towards a better future. We connected the geometry and the mural to the shapes and phrases in our piece of music. We hope you enjoy the pop wind ensemble and astral artist Annie Wu's performance of Andante Cantabile.
name is Annie Wu. I'm a flutist with Astro Artists, and I'm so excited to be presenting this concert in collaboration with Plan Philly and Mural Arts Philadelphia. You just heard from the students themselves what connections they see between the mural they chose, Staircases and Mountaintops, and the ensemble piece we just played. I wanted to share a little story about the process, though. We worked for about a month, um, meeting on Zoom and talking through how we wanted to put this piece together. And I asked the students at the end, what are you going to take with you beyond? And a few of them said they really love the lesson that all of music, and particularly in this piece, is about teamwork. How can we create a piece together? And you just also heard that there are a lot of solo lines that we pass like a baton to each other. And in, in this time in particular, we're recording our individual solo lines in our own homes separately, and yet we have to channel our peers, come up with a communal idea, and really bring them into our space. I like this idea in collaboration with the mural because not only does it you know, bring to mind the, this image of holding hands and progressing and moving forward, but also the idea that these classical forms, this classical music that sometimes doesn't feel like it's given the time of day in modern society, has so many connections to today. This idea of collaborating, of making something together. And it's really the voice of young people that help us decide how we want to tell this story. Um, for my own solo flute piece and mural collaboration, I wanted to pick something that was similar to that sentiment, and so I chose Common Threads. You'll see the mural in a second, but it shows um, all these classical forms and figures in classical and traditional outfits, and in parallel, Philadelphia high schoolers, and they're wearing their own clothing, but mirroring this these regal gestures. And to me, it makes us think about how do we take the past and bring it into the future? And I think the answer is through the stories and thoughts of young people. So this collaboration was so meaningful to me and the piece that I paired with it was the Karg Ellert Chacon. And a Chacon I think is perfect for this because the whole idea is that you have pedal tones and in this case, four notes that are descending. So sort of grounding ourselves instead of the ascent. And you have variations on these four tones. You're always hearing these four notes underneath. And in this piece, it's about five minutes, you're gonna hear bubbling ones, you're gonna hear happier ones, and also ones that are quite dark and tumultuous. So there's all sorts of ways of looking at the past and telling new stories. My favorite part of the mural is the young woman in the center, who's also a Philadelphia high school, a real person that the artist met and portrayed, and she doesn't have a classical counterpart. And this to me says that she's the largest one. There's so much in the future that we can take this music into and how we can start collaborating with each other and thinking about all the different connections that bring us into the 21st century. So with that, thank you for listening to our concert called Connections. This is Kark Ellert's Chicane.